Hey guys, it is Cheesy here, and today I'm bringing you another Fallout 4 video. In this video, I'm going to be breaking Fallout 4 even further by showing you guys what happens when you kill everyone in F Vault 111 pre-war. Um, a couple of things before I start, this is only possible on PC with mods and console commands. I use the mod No Essential NPCs, which I'll link in the description. If you're on PC, I definitely re recommend that you check it out. Um, also, no secret dialogue or cutscenes will really trigger, so if you're looking for something really special, that won't really happen. But the video is definitely not pointless, it's very fun, and it's still worth your time, in my opinion. I kind of just want to test out the game and test out the code and just have fun. Um, lastly guys, if you want to see Fatal Krauser shoot everybody in Vault 111 for fun, I'll link him in the video. Um, he does his best to break Fallout 4 on console, so definitely check him out. Getting straight into it guys, I opened up the console and typed in kill all. The kill all command kills everyone around me, and as you see here, um, it does uh, exactly that. So then I just walked around, and as you can see, everyone is dead. Um, the Vault Tech security, um, you know, the Vault Tech overseer, um, the residents, and even my spouse. And speaking of that, I make other videos where I break Fallout 4, such as killing my spouse before the Vault, um, killing the Vault Tech rep pre-war, killing Codsworth pre-war, killing Kellogg before he kills my spouse, and much more. So I definitely re recommend that um, you check out those videos after watching this one. So after uh, the, um, after walking around and looking at all the dead bodies, I um, f walked to the decon decontamination pod, only to realize that I was unable to step inside it. So instead of ending the video there, I reloaded to the point where um, to the point where before I killed everybody, and waited for the option to enter the pod. Once I was able to enter the pod, I was th I then opened up the console and killed everybody. Once again, I typed in the kill all command and it kills everybody around me. So then guys, I stepped inside the pod. Um, once I was in there, I waited for something to happen. Um, as a matter of fact, I actually ended up waiting for like 10 minutes. Um, after 10 minutes, unfortunately, nothing really happened. Um, However, after 10 minutes, I opened up the console and typed in Enable Player Controls. Um, this gives you control of the player and it should let you leave the pod. However, after toggling free camera and turning off collision, I was unable to leave. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you enjoy videos like these, make sure to subscribe for unique follow content. And also feel free to leave a like and drop a comment on what you think. Um, thank you guys for watching, and once again, make sure to check out my other Fallout videos, and I will see you later. Bye.